Hey, all right, so here I am <laughs> near the war bag, and uh, people are going to ask me, what, what the hell is this? <laughs> this is not body armor. It might seem to be that. It's a weight vest. Hey, it's a secret to training, to getting better. It, with uh, combat judo material, you, can, uh, you need to practice with the weight vest just to get used to it. I developed the, the ability to use it in real settings. As I said before, this is not a self-defense, uh, watered-down karate school uh, thing at all. Uh, and I'm going to tell you right now, at the uh, Combat Judo Alpha Camp, it's basically it's going to be run as a camp, like I said, based on the Alamo Scouts camp. Uh, this is going to be two days, August 26th, 27th. This is the next one, 2017 at the Barn of Truth facility, Perrysville, Ohio, midway between Cleveland and Columbus. you got to make it out. This is going to be unlike anything you've ever done. I don't care if you've done karate stuff, if you've done boxing, kickboxing, MMA, BJJ seminars, clinics, workshops, training all the time. And none of the things you've done is going to be like this. It's going to be incredible. Like I said, we're going to do some water training. Uh, nothing extensive as the Alamo Scouts did. <laughs> we were the pre-runners for all the special operations groups in the United States. Uh, and I'll go into that at the at the camp and tell a little bit about that. Marine Raiders also use combat judo. Marine Raiders are probably well more well known because there were a lot more people, more Marine Raiders than there were Alamo Scouts. Alamo Scouts basically qualification is different, but it's like Delta is now. That's how hard it was to get into. So very few people in it overall. But anyway, what I'm going to talk to you about is that this is going to be the most functional fighting skills, real fighting skills that you've ever gotten. It's guaranteed and it's going to happen in a very short period of time. Like I'm saying, these other guys training in uh, sport fighting isn't going to cut it. And uh, hopefully you've seen on my different channels, my Facebook pages and groups about how sport fighters get killed in certain attacks in the street. Uh, <coughs> street just being anywhere that's not the ring or the cage type of fighting. Totally different way you have to construe things. A lot of things that people take uh, for being given, for example, in sport training are not how it is out here in reality. Not whatsoever. Uh, this is one of the reasons why we do things wearing weight because you're going to be carrying weight in normal life that you're not carrying in the ring or the cage. So this makes everything different. Try to try, for example, try to do a double leg or a single leg wearing this. Uh, this is just 20 pounds so wearing at least 20 pounds or more. Try it. Let's see how it works out for you. Anyway, I'm guaranteeing this. This is incredible stuff. We're we're pumped up, the people who are coming so far, who have confirmed. Oh, you need to confirm, by the way. You need to uh, – there's going to be an uh, access fee uh, to the people who pay at the door because we have logistics, and we're setting things up for the number of people we have. Uh, and then we're going to do a little bit extra uh, planning for the other people who don't. If we know about you, we got you set up. We already have a group leader picked for the uh, trainees uh, is a good guy. He's going to be there to be the group leader for everybody going through it. Uh, as I said, you can have to, you're going to have two uh, <coughs> senior master trainers, senior master trainer Sailor, uh, senior master trainer Clugston. That would be myself. <laughs> and uh, then uh, because uh, this is States. First time in the United States that this has been run. And this is, as I said, guaranteed. This is going to be totally different than anything you've done before. I don't care what you've done, what you've thought you've done. It's not going to prepare you for the reality on the street like we are. Uh, this is for violently being attacked in a mob scene, which has happened like in Ferguson and the United States, among other places. Uh, if, and we're going to cover what to do in that situation because you're going to be trained to react. This is also how to react in a military situation, meaning group fight, mob violence, crowd violence, uh, home invasion, uh, trying to carjack you, trying to uh, rob you at an ATM. All those things are going to be covered because this is specifically designed fighting. This is war fighting. This is not sport fighting. It's in completely different the strategy and tactics that the tier one guys are going to learn that are coming through 
is totally different than what you've done because self-defense in your karate, martial arts, schools, boxing, kickboxing, MMA, they teach techniques. They have no clue about what I'm talking about with strategy and tactics, and I'm not going to give it away here. So that's it. Come to the uh, Combat Judo Alpha Camp, 26th and 27th of August. Uh, there's a link below to go to the combat hyphen judo Dot com page you can sign up there we want to see you there because it's getting big and like i said a huge history behind this started with jacardo cano but really grabbed traction in world war ii and it's evolved since then you're going to see uh, what's happened you're going to hear some of the history you're going to learn about the marine raiders you're going to learn about the Alamo scouts that was the army uh who took in some other people just like delta will accept people from all the services guys ever made it <laughs> into Telta. Uh, anyway, so the uh, so the factor is, okay, check it out. I'm telling you, this is functional beyond anything you've ever done before. Guaranteed, okay? It's going to be wild. It's going to be fun. It's, and it's just, that's all I can say. So combat judocom going to see you there on behalf of the senior master trainer, Sailor, and myself. We're going to evolve you. Okay, you're going to go through evolutions. All right, see ya.